Welcome back everybody. I have spent the night sleeping under the awning of Olaf's farmhouse. My fire is still going, as you can see. Well, you can't really. You can't really see. Because it's a bit of a foggy morning around. I am making my way back to Balmora with all of my samples of stuff. I feel a bit bad leaving the fire going, but... Maybe he can just use it, eh? There's a dude over there, but I have things to do. This is the woman that I brought to this place. The Fields of Gmu. I think I'm supposed to go across to the island on the other side of the lake and get some muck it's there and present it and something happens. Magical. But I'm not going to do that, because lots of magical things will happen if I go back to the Mages Guild. I'm a bit stunned that I've left some berries, but then I was getting a bit overexcited about where the shrine was, so I'll just quickly go and get those. There we go. Right. So, I need to be here... And at the moment, I'm having to walk because I don't have, or at least I don't think I have, any quick way of getting home. Oh, actually, I have. I have. Because I must have bought myself some for an emergency, but I don't really want to use it. Not right now. Eventually, I'll probably end up drowning in the things, but I think I can cope with a walk. We're going to come up here for the views and stuff. Except there are no views and stuff. Because you can't see anything. Wow. That's a lot of fog. Hmm, actually ended up around the back of a place. A ruin of some sort. Right, can I slide down here without killing myself? Not guaranteed. No. Ah. Nope, we're good. God, they look amazing, don't they? I don't, don't really see buildings like this from multiple angles. You don't see them from angles other than the way they tell you to go for the quest. That's a lot of rumbling. So a lot of flapping. So actually, is it that path that I need to take? Yes, it is. I need a better amulet of stamina that just refills the bar. That would be my first aim in life, I think. Along with a million other first aims. <laughs> I don't really know what's going on. It sounds like an earthquake. It's funny how it goes from just burnt and scorched and generally unpleasant to this. Okay, right. Just to make sure that I'm not ending up going completely out my way, I'm gonna get off the path and <laughs> take route one. It's clearing up. Right, can I actually get up there? Drat. Is that why there's a path? <laughs> oh no! Right, fine. Boing back down the hill. Oh no. You know what's coming, so we might as well preempt it. Oh, 
Ow. Right, can I have your innards? Yay! I better check the sign. Balmora, that way. I've actually <laughs> probably ended up walking out of my way. <laughs> Is it because there's a hill in the way? That way? It's got to be, hasn't it? Yeah, it's got to be. I can see a cart. I do like a good cart. Who is this? Travelling merchant. Oh, there's multiple people. Mage, hello. Warrior, you're not a warrior, you're a thingy. Caravanner. Any time now. Warrior? Yes. Oh Goodness, I wouldn't want to try and steal from you. I oh, know, it doesn't sell anything. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. It's actually a guy kind of stuck in there. <laughs> dear, oh dear. <laughs> that doesn't look good. Oh, well, I'm assuming he must supply something? He's not going anywhere. That's weird. Okay, that's weird. I'm not going to ask too many questions. If I try and look in their boxes, they'll probably stab me, so I'm not going to do that. Okay, right. Yes, good. So when I get back, what I need to do is give up the mushroom samples and have lunch. And try and find a better stab stamulet. Hey, if I make my own, that's what it's going to be called. The stamulet. Okay, awesome, great. Managed to do that with minimal drama. I'm trying really hard to get back running, but no. It's very quiet. Where is everybody? Ooh. Yes, Outlander. Hello. Do I want more duties? Or, uh, fairness. I haven't really done the first one yet, yes, so what do you want? probably not right now. Oh, phew, that was a little adventure. Right. It's actually lovely in here, isn't it? It's really nice. I, I might spills in town. I might have this as my house. Like if, if I just block off this, this entrance bit, so that nobody else can get in. I could have four beds. Keep all my stuff in the wardrobe. Yeah, sounds like a plan. Who needs to buy a house? Well, actually, I need to buy a house. I haven't forgotten. I am excited about this. Notice of sale. Need to go and see somebody at the Grand, Grand Council Chambers in Ebonheart about house. I have a feeling at the moment that I'm not going to have anything for 242 gold pieces, though. It needs potions? No, you need mushrooms. Woohoo! What did I get? Restore health potions. Okay. What else can I do? You have met, made a bet with Galbadir. And you want me to give her a fake soul gem. 
take it and put it in her desk upstairs. She should be coming downstairs to talk with Marine Drin, so nobody will see me do this thing. Mischief. First okay. the vision, then the conjuration. This is unsettling. That looks familiar. An oath is an oath. No, not, not coming. Oh, coming! <gasps> Quick! I hope there's nobody else upstairs. Although, I don't know how anybody else would know. Because, unless this desk is booby trapped, done it. Right. Is this the bit where she comes running back? No, no chaos has happened. Oh, phew, just in time. Okay. <laughs> Hello, Outlander. Hello. I hope you won't take too much of my time. It needs potions. No, if we keep having this discussion, I have put the gem in the desk. You must now study local flowers. You need samples of... Oh, hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. I've just been to Lake Amaya. And I've picked all of the flowers, right? Results! <laughs> there we go. It does pay to pick everything. Do you want the rest as well? What else do you want? A new ceramic bowl. Give me some money. Results. We need to go to Revere the Trader. Okay. Where is Revere the Trader? You're not going to tell me. Okay, I'll find it myself. Do you want something? Do you know, I actually do. What do you think about me blocking up the entrance of this and just making it into my own home? I don't know where the rest of you would sleep. But then I don't really know where the rest of you sleep anyway, because there are only four beds. You must have to take it in turns. That's one thing that has always bothered me is, like, where do people actually sleep and live and stuff? Like, where do you Let's actually live? Where do you live? Where do you live? Do you just kind of go around all the major skills nick in the beds when you can? <laughs> yes, Alanda. What do you want? I think even the guards have beds, technically. Right, anyway, I'm wandering around here without even looking where I'm going. I did see Revere the Trader somewhere. There. 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 There, here. This one, right. Dark in here. Hello. Hello. Welcome. This one will buy from us, yes. You want to buy your favourite Daedric weapons? Well, I do, but not right now. Welcome, friend. Right, ceramic bowl. Which of these looks like a ceramic bowl? That's a redware bowl. That's a decorative bowl. Ceramic bowl. Okay, right, what will I barter for it? Well, I've got so much stuff. Do you want a manatee flipper, which is the most random item I've ever heard of? And maybe... I could probably sell you some other things, to be honest. Am I likely to need the rest of this willow anther? Because if not worth quite a lot of cash, although you're not prepared to give me quite a lot of cash for it, are you? So I'll just buy that for one gold piece. Profit of nine gold pieces. What do you think of Balmora, Outlander? Actually quite like it. Very, very quiet though. <laughs> Except in here. I always wonder about this, right? So we're, what, under the town now? I can never quite work out where... I mean, there's a cat up a tree in here. Why Why would it matter? But yeah, I can never quite work out. Are we underneath the shops? Are we underneath... Are we under a hill? I don't know. Magic is my speciality. I think it might be magic. How can I help? It needs potions? No! Oh, oop. Vajira must find her stolen reports. Need your help. 
Galbadir has stolen the reports on the properties of local mushrooms and flowers. I won't stand for it. I won't stand for it. That was quite a journey to get those mushrooms and flowers right. Where? Where? In a desk? Not in yes, a desk. Breton? No, not it's not in a desk though. Right, all of this is owned, so if it's not poking around in these sacks. I'll just end up getting my head blown off, probably. Owned, owned, owned. Mage's Guild Charter not owned. I have the finest spells in town. Right, in my bedroom. Oh, oh, hello. There is the flower report, interestingly. It's worth money. Might not give it back. Okay, right. Got the flowers one. Is it? I reckon the other one's probably like in a desk somewhere. I greet you Please. as a friend. Feel free. Talk at your leisure. Might she be hiding it on her person? So I have to pickpocket it. In the chest? Nope. Over here. Good to see you. Nope. Is there something Do you need my me? services? Do you know where it is? I should probably not ask. Stolen reports. It's an unfortunate situation. Back when I was an apprentice here, we had to find our own reports when a jealous rival stole them. But I suppose you want to know where the scroll is. I can't say for sure, but I sure get, saw Galbadir rummaging, rummaging about among the sacks and barrels across from the stairway. Mm -hmm. Sacks and barrels. Hello. In the barrels? Oh, hang on. Look. There. Got it. I think we all know what that was in revenge for. I'm actually a quicker boinger than I am a walker. Hello! A potion today? <sighs> With the hard sell all the time. Right, I've got your reports. Ooh, ooh! Exclusive fire shield, frost shield, lightning shield, and spell absorption. Nice. Right, is that it? No, it is. That is it. Cool. Right. I will have a potion, what? though. What do you have? What could I do with? What could I do without? I could do without carrying around some rando's left glove. I know that much, but I've now got tons. So fire shields are worth a fortune. I'd rather have the money. There's something I don't quite understand, actually. Now, I don't understand how a potion could create a shield around you. It sort of feels like a spell thing. But anyway, we'll get rid of these fortify willpower potions because I never use stuff like that. And then... What can I not use? Black Anther. Bungler's Bane. Uh, gold Canet. And Crash Fibre. And Netch Leather. Rat meat. All the others look like they might be useful at some point. So I would like some. Uh, oh, restore strength is probably going to be useful. And oh, levitation. And how many health potions have I just got? Rubbishy health potions, just cheap ones probably do with three of those as well and i was thinking a bit of alcohol that one that's the best one we'll have a bit of that nice don't suppose you no you don't buy old guys clothes no okay how much of this can i get away with selling you then that much yes Profit. Nice. Right, did she say she sold spells? What you got? Do not disturb me unless you have money. Ooh, shock. On touch. Paralysis on touch. <laughs> Poisonous touch. It's all on the touch. You see, I could buy those and then make myself either a cool amulet or I could actually learn to touch people and shock them. Touch people and paralyze them. 
Yes. Oh, that one's ranged. Create a big cloud of poison. Maybe not right now. But to, oh, feather. I'll take that as well, because I feel like that might be useful later. And I've got a bit of cash, haven't I? I've got I a bit have of cash. The spells in yes, what have you got? Oh, you've what got spells want? as well. Do you need Ooh. something, Outlander? Okay, what have you got? Calm creature and calm humanoid. They might help at some point. Swift swim. That's cheap. I'll just have that. Water breathing. Oh, levitate. Oh, he's got levitate. <gasps> it's a bit expensive, though. Right, but he's got levitate. He's also got open door. Water breathing. I've got water walking. Perhaps I should get water breathing to match. I'm listening. There we go. But yeah, he's got levitate it's just really expensive but soon soon i will be able to use that i'm sure I just realized i've still got a ceramic bowl <laughs> did i never oh. fine ended up with a stupid ceramic bowl right what am i going to do now go and speak to the woman upstairs but also probably get rid of some other stuff this has been very relaxing i have to say Hello. Good to see you. Do I want more duties? Yes. Services. <gasps> I might be ready for advancement. What am I now? I am Yenvir's the apprentice. The apprentice. What was I before? The low life. Uh. Oh, she wants to. No. What am I now? The journeyman. Can I have another one? <gasps> the evoker. Oh, I love it. Evoking all the things. Nice. Right. I need someone to convince an ex Talvani to join us. While you're there, you can collect Manway's guild dues. Okay. He's in Solipund, which is along the trail from Panabi. <laughs> That's meaningless to me. Cross the bridge just north of the fort that leads into Molag Amur. Well, you know I'm not going to do that. I'll probably find some other way of getting there. <laughs> Okay, right, cool. Manway has failed to pay her dues for several years. That implies that I might uh, need to pay dues at some point. I mean, this stuff doesn't come for free, does it? Being Yes, Outlander, what may I do for you? Being called an evoker and given a load of stuff in a chest does not come for free. They're going to get me at some point. Right, let's have a look. On the map. Caldera. Mirandus. Oh, it's not that far away from the fields of that we went to. Hey, that's kind of cool. Okay. So I need to go to Mirandus. Oh, I have actually got the proper instructions here. I should leave Balmora East, pass Fort Moonmouth, cross the bridge to Molag Amur, follow the trail east until I reach a lake. I should see a Dunmer stronghold to the south. If I head north on the path between the hills, Sullipund will be on my left. I'm so glad I wrote all this down. So, there's the lake. So I kind of need to just get to here, don't I? It's some, going to be somewhere around here. It's going to be a bit of a journey. Maybe on another bit of a walk. Let's go to the bookseller and get rid of these books that I started to collect. Any time now. Go ahead, I'm waiting. Right. Oh, the I just thought, actually, the Journal of Tar Heel is ultimately probably a one-off, so I'll keep that one. But I will need somewhere to put it. Then, Short History of Morrowind. Was that what I was supposed to give to somebody? I think I was supposed to give that to somebody. The Yellow Book of Rings. The Invocation of Azura. Food of the Gods. Famous drinks of Tamriel. Nice. Right. Can I have a couple of... No. <laughs> one? One extra gold piece? Yeah. Cool. Right. So, after all of that, how much money have I got now? 620 gold pieces. I, it's still not enough for a house, is it? Let's face it. But I do feel like I might be able to get a better weapon than a dire viper blade go back to Revere. Let's boing back to Revere. Yes, sir. Citizen. Over there. 
That's new. Right, what you got, mate? What can you do for you? Demon Tanto. Bound dagger for 60 seconds on self. Fiend Tanto. Bound dagger for 60 seconds on self and lightning shield. Field Katana. Oh, that's a long blade. I'm a bit of a short blade specialist. That one's 3,000 gold. Really? I don't think that's worth it. But I am wondering about the demon Tanto. 5656. 66. Six. What have I got? 484858 four, and poison. I also have this iron spark sword. I tell you what. I'll trade you the Iron Spark Sword and the Chitin Short Sword for the Demon Tanto, just because it sounds cool. But you can also have some shoes and a robe and a hat. You're not having the glove. I might actually do something useful with that at some point. Um, I think that might be about it for the time being. So... Got anything else interesting, have you? It's got a silver dagger. That might be worth knowing about because you can enchant those. If I wanted an enchanted dagger, <laughs> it's got a, a brown brain coral. <laughs> what? And, um, oh, he's actually got some gauntlets. I'll have some gauntlets. Okay, right. I'm not paying that though. Oh, come on, mate. Boo! No bargains around here. Right. That will protect me a little bit, hopefully. On the way to this place I've got to go to. Now, have I got any food before we leave? Two apples. I roasted some cork bulb root. Oh, I've actually got 16. 16 roasted cork bulb root. High in fibre. Not sure that the apple and cork bulb root diet is going to be taken off anytime soon. But, right, so this is the road. Back to the fort. Hello. Oh, look. Oh, they are lovely. I'll try not to kill you. I'll just look. Hello. He's so funny. Does it do anything if I... No, it doesn't. What about you? Do you do anything? No. <laughs> Stop fiddling with the wildlife. Right. a fort. That's the way I came from, isn't it? So. Ooh, look at my hands. Look all Halloween-y. Leave Balmora East, past Fort Moonmouth, and then cross the bridge to Molag Amur. Molag Amur, sorry, not Molag Right, there is the fort. So I just need to get past the fort one way or another. Okay. Well, I know there's no bridge that way, although there is somebody just standing. I found these randos who just stand around all the time. So... See, if I could learn to levitate, I could just fly over everything. This is an excellent idea. Okay, 
Let's get a view from up here. I just like going up in this game. Okay, right. That is a bridge. So she said to go across the bridge and follow the trail east. Okay, right. Who is this? Take that. Oh, what? Oh god, he's got skills. Oh my god, what the hell? Oh god, what? 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 Right, now hang on a second. Is this where my demon Tanto comes into play? Oh god, have I got anything? I haven't got anything. Oh no. I haven't got anything I can zap. I should have got some zappy stuff before I set out on this. Instead I bought a load of spells that I probably can't use. Could I try and paralyse him? I've only got a 48% chance of doing that. Drat. Right, okay. It's fine. It's fine. Could, could have levitated over him. Shall I try and paralyse him? Oh god! Oh that's bad. That's that's bad. Although he's not very really, he's not really good at doing that. He's quite good at doing that. Oh my god. Okay, right. Stab him. Stab him. Stab him. Attempt to paralyse him. Go home. Get some better stuff. Yeah. How am I gonna? I've got no ranged anything, have I? Oh, great. No. Nah. Right. I'm going in. I'm going in. I'm going in. Oh. Oh. oh, I have managed to poison him. I've managed to stab him. I've stabbed him. I've poisoned him. Oh, right. Quick. Potions. Potions. I've bought potions. Yes, potions. Potions. That axe looks huge. I'd rather that didn't hit me. Thanks. Oh, oh check it out. Check it out! Snowy Granius, if indeed that is your real name. I don't want any of that. Hey, I did it! I did it! I got past the dude! I wonder if that, whether that was a Mage's Guild test, although I did stab him rather than paralysing him, so... It wasn't much of a test. Is he guarding this? <gasps> oh, hello. 200 gold. That one's only worth 20, but I'll take it. <gasps> money. More money. More money. Was that really worth losing your life over? Okay. So I've got to go east. This way. By the looks of things. Yeah. It said Molag Umur, didn't it? A door there. There's a door, but I'm not doing that right now. Whatever that is. Well, I was taking mushrooms. Now I've taken life. But if you're gonna do that, I'm gonna get annoyed with you. Okay. She said take the path. I sort of feel like the path is leading me somewhere I don't want to go, so. I'll come back down again. Maybe it was... Maybe this is the path. Mm, need my stamulet. Neither of these seem to go the way that I want to go, so I'll just guess. Yep. Okay. I'll gather some stuff then. This way? Yeah, there is actually a path I should probably be following, but... Ooh! I've never been... Oh god, what the hell? Oh no, I think he's seen me. 
drat. Drat. Oh no, what is this? What is this? This place is dangerous, man. What the hell? But although this fight may well be in slow motion. <laughs> Hello? Right, can I poison you in the same way as that I poisoned that other bloke? Oh god, it's not even human, is it? I have contracted black heart blight. Well, I might have done, but I've also killed this ash foundling. It doesn't even have anything worth it. I've contracted blight. Great. Great. That's massively affecting my strength and endurance. Now, did was I sensible? Did I? No, I didn't buy anything to cure stuff with. Did I? Great. don't like it. Well, I'll practice healing myself. Ooh. First try. Right, so I'm not bad at killing things. Not really. That dagger that cost me all of 17 gold pieces. Actually pretty good. I don't like it around here. Can I just say? I don't like it. Uh, I can see why she's made me come out here. There's a lot of rumbling and there's some weird singing or something going on. I don't like it. I also don't like the fact that the path seems to have just ended. Cross the bridge. Follow the trail east until I reach a lake. Okay, well this is dead east, but I wouldn't be following the trail unless this is the trail. A bit steep to be the trail. That looks traily. It's just it going. It's going over there. There's a door. There's a door over there. I don't fancy that. Hmm. Again, this is where levitation would come in super handy because you could just fly over it all. It wouldn't matter. I can't get up here. Ooh, it's getting dark. I don't like it. Right. So have, did I just lose the trail then? Because this is this is quite traily. I feel. Can I get up there? No. Did the trail go off in multiple directions and I didn't notice because something was trying to kill me? Because it can be quite distracting, that you know. Ah, oh, yeah. Right. This. This is the trail that I want, maybe? <laughs> it still seems to be going a way that I don't really want to go. I don't like this. I don't like it. It's scary. Okay, right. Does the trail maybe go down and then round? I always feel better when I see signposts because it does at least mean that somebody has been here before. <laughs> well, that's going back to Balmora. I don't want to do... I don't know. I, don't, I want to go over there. Oh, I don't like it. I don't like it. And now it's dark. What time is it? Seven o'clock. Okay, so not like... Not mad late. But nevertheless, dark. Right, this, this looks like the trail, right? This is the trail. I'm starting to see things in the rocks now. I thought that was a person. Okay, maybe the trail is just really windy. This definitely just goes to a door. She's either given me completely duff instructions or I've just got this really, really wrong. Follow the wrong trail. Okay, I actually can get over here. So... Right, 
Right, there, there's a bit of trail. That's a bit of trail right there. And it seems to be heading east. I see some very pretty flowers down here. Fire fern. Don't mind if I do. That'll be the next thing, won't it? Can you get us some flowers from inside a volcano? Okay, well. I don't think we're in the Ascadian Isles anymore. I could camp here, be quite warm. Oh dear, my stamina is low and I need to catch my breath. Maybe I should camp here then. Fine, I'll do that. I don't think there's anything dodgy around. So, I'm going to camp next to this lava pit because what could possibly go wrong? And I hope that you will join me in the next episode when hopefully it will have got lighter and I'll find my way to the lake. I really don't like it around here.